Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, the Brooke Ashley. Today, we have something really fun for y'all today. Um, I am doing a champagne taste test, okay? And I have my charcuterie tray right here for y'all. Um, I'm going to be taste testing sh three different champagnes. One is a high-end champagne, one is a moderate price champagne, and the other is, I guess you could say, it's a lower priced champagne. So um, I'm not gonna know what um, what I'm drinking until I flip over one of the cards that's gonna come underneath the glass. So I can't wait, guys. So in the meantime, between time, I'm gonna pop a grape in. Mm, so good. Mm, so, 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 so good. Ooh, I see one right here. Ooh, thank you. Let's see what let's see what it is, guys. So I'm gonna take a sip right now. Oh, this is good. Okay, wait, I think I know which one this is. I'm gonna guess. I'm gonna go with Verve Clicquot. Okay, let's see if I'm right. Oh, guys, I was wrong. I was wrong. So this right here is the cheap champagne that is only $15. This is the Duvernay Ice Champagne. I'm cracking up. Wow, I, wow, I was fooled. I was fooled. Wow, who knew the $15 champagne would taste so good? That was very good. Have another grape. Mm. Oh, the second glass. Thank you. All right, guys, this is the second glass. Let me take a sip. Okay, so I'm going to take... Let me take another sip. Oh, my goodness. I can't... I can't, um... If I say Verve Clicquot again and it's the mid price champagne, I'm gonna scream. Okay, I'm gonna go with the mid price Jacquard. Um, I forgot the name of it, the whole name, but it's the Jacquard, and this one was the $30 champagne. Let me see if I'm right. I was right! It's the Jacquard Brute! I was right, y'all! This is the mid price $30 champagne! Woo! I got it! All right, let's get ready for the last glass, which we already know. Thank you. This is the Verve Clicquot. And the Verve Clicquot, yellow label, $60. Okay, guys, I'm screaming because this first glass, the cheap stuff, Is actually very good. I, I would actually recommend this. You would actually think this is Verve Clicquot, to be honest with you. All right, so I'm gonna have some of my charcuterie tray. I'm gonna put the links down below in the description to see everything that I um, use for the charcuterie tray, if you guys wanna know. So guys, here are the bottles that were used. Thank you. Thank you. So this is the cheap glass right here. This is the cheap bottle, $15. This is the Verve DuVernay. And it, I have to say, guys, if you want to ball on a budget, I would really recommend this. I would actually drink this. If you serve this to me at a party, I would be pleasantly surprised. The mid-range, I thought it was good. I thought it was really good. Another, if you don't want to break the bank, it's $30, some bang for your buck. I like this a lot. And then last but not least, my tried and true. This is my favorite. I love Verve Clicquot. And fun fact, I just found out that it's Verve, it's pronounced Verve Clicquot, not Vouve Clicquot. I know it's confusing because there's no R in it. But yeah, that sound, that E and that U and that V sound, that together, it makes an R sound. I actually Googled it. I was like, oh wow, I've been saying it wrong all this time. So yeah, this is 
delicious. You can never go wrong with it. It has that like really pretty orange. I actually call it Hermes orange. <laughs> Because they do look um, very similar. But yeah, I had such a good time. Let me know what you guys thought. Um, you guys want to know more about my charcuterie tray and what I have in it. I'm going to leave the links of where you can find the food and the grapes and the chips all down below in the description. And thank you guys so much for joining me. This was so much fun. You know I love my champagne. So I thought I would do a really fun taste test. And we will be doing more of these again. So cheers to you guys and I'll see you guys later.